Welcome you guys to the Serge Normand John Frieda Salon. This is where I cut hair in New York. It's where I take most of my clients. This has been home for me for the last couple years. In this moment of mousse, I'm gonna bring on a special guest, my wife's best friend, Talitha. I do some like French twists and some, um, some really cool, ethereal, sexy hairstyles to show you. It's gonna be a good ride. You guys are gonna, uh, gonna love this. So welcome aboard, French twist, moment of mousse. Australian. Oh! Okay, she's Australian. She's Australian like my wife, my <laughs> wife Laura. <laughs> Maybe we do a different twist on the French twist and we do it like, doesn't all the water spin the wrong way in Australia? Or yeah. maybe it spins the right way and it spins the wrong way here. That's probably what it is. Boomerang French twists? I don't know. All right guys. Are we ready? Because we're gonna knock this out. We don't have very many chances with this. Welcome to Matt's Minute of Moose. Guest star Talitha from Down Under. Okay, all right, so when you, we are working with the French twist, the biggest thing to do is to create a ton of volume. So what I like to do is really lightly and vigorously back brush the hair as much as you can. You wanna do as much of it as possible. I'm just gonna do a little bit of it because um, I want to get a, something that I can pin into. Thumb down and wrap the hair up. Whoop, shoo, like this. Then you can take your pin, go into your twist, into your hair, and then it's like, boom, done. So that's kind of how, then you like make it all cool. Shoo, shoo, shoo. Make it cool, make it cool. This is kind of like our super messy, cool girl French twist. But the most important thing is, that thumb down when you wrap the hair around because that's what gives it this twist. I love to keep pieces out like this. I think that's really cool. Um, this one we can call like, it's basically the same thing, but I call this one the French twist ponytail where you just slightly twist it like that and keep it very chic. And at the same time, again, in with the pin, lock it in. And now it's like this really cool ponytail moment. Um, okay, so there's like our French twist ponytail. A couple things I also like to do is do it in two parts. Sometimes it's too hard and you can do something a little more punk. So we do like this sort of mohawk section. I love his moose, he's buying me time. Okay, and you do kind of the same thing. So I would go thumb down and you can kind of wrap hair into this little knot. And you do like a little knot and then again, when we are pinning, it's like you always pin into the hair and then down into the base. And you can do like a little knot. Um, so yeah, the way I love to work is just, I like it to be very carefree. I like it to look effortless. Twist, twist, twist. Let's maybe do this kind of vibe. I'm gonna be here all day. This moose is not going anywhere. Talitha, you have like the magic touch. <laughs> so just with these three little, three little twists, you get more of a take on like this kind of vibe, which I really think is pretty special. This is like a great look for if you need to go to weddings or, you know, it's kind of like a cool way to stay young with your look but still be very elegant. You know, it all, it all comes down to um, shape, balance, texture. You know, even up here, we mess this up a little bit more, make that look really kind of cool. And then that way from the profile, it kind of has this lift. There is a little bit on some takes on my French twist that I love. And I also, um, can I? <laughs> oh yeah, we're still, we're still pretty, uh, we still have a little bit of time. Let's see if I can, okay. So then for one last little look, We'll do like a um, wedding inspired cool girl or, but the bottom is like, is in a little chignon. Chignon, French word, chignon. Maybe I'll try this left-handed. Thumb down. Ooh, this is interesting. Ugh. So you get that twist. Again, lock in a couple pins.
This hair's already secure up here, so I'm going to take this pin up into that hair and lock that down. Okay, so I think that is gonna basically be it. Um, I'm going to squash the timer like that. So I'll squash the timer. You guys can smash that like and that subscribe button. Talitha, you really, really helped me out today. Thank you. I appreciate your Frenchness. <laughs> Anytime. And, um, yeah, we, oui, we, oui, right, or whatever. Um, I'm gonna get so much hate. You guys can totally make fun of me in the comment section, but um, let's keep talking up views. I would love to be able to do these moments of moose with you as fast as I can, fire off the information that I love to share with you all. Yeah, that's basically it. We'll leave you in this one for a sec. This is really cute. Laura, thank you so much behind the camera for all your hard work, honey. Another episode down the drain of Matt's moment of moose. <laughs>